competitor she is. You've shared the mat before, coming out on top now and into the final. Yeah, um, me personally, this is the biggest achievement of my career so far. You know, I've got to a, got to the final of a major competition. I think personally, I rate this higher than the World Championships, but that's just because of the calibre of the event, how popular it is, and stuff. So, for me to be in the final of this competition, especially losing the quarters last year. So, Means the world to me, so Absolutely, it means the world to me. I'm sure it means the world to your family who are probably listening at home. Yeah, definitely. I think I told them yesterday I got through the quarters and they thought I medalled, but I was like, nah, there's a rep of charge. I guess they'll go by again. But I think that was probably my fault in the commentary <laughs> box. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm just glad I've got a medal secure now, but it's not the colour I want yet. So Absolutely. One more. One more and best of luck for the final, and I shall enjoy this semi final. You can go and have a rest. Thank you very much. Cheers. Thanks a lot, Lauren. So who's going to join Lauren Williams in the final? Gwal Fe or Noor Tatar Ascari? We've got the ringside seats here. And the expert insight there from Lauren Williams. Not easy to give that literally direct post-match interview there. Didn't even get a chance to ask her about her buddy Bradley, who's also in the final. Who's going to join her? Tatar Ascari, of course, superb competitor. It's her always a tough fighter to handle. Won the Grand Slam qualifiers earlier in the year. Last year won the World Championships as well. Decorated career for Ascari Gwalyun Fe. Grand Slam silver medalist from this time last year. Yeah, the in the Grand Prix, but going for yeah. the main goal in this one, points on the board in the first. As you can see, it stands at 0-0. Zero, zero. Yeah. The fighters eyeballing each other, neither wanting to overcommit. Committing readily to this one. Both fighters, nothing doing on the board. They're so caught up there in the success of Williams making it through. Bradley Sinden as well, forgot to mention. Great Prince Jay Jones as well, also through. Joined by Amina of Korea. And then the 49s who goes against Panapak Wong Patanakit. Yang Yushao going against Jiang Chun in the men's 58s. Li De Hoon out, Bradley Sinden in. Against Zhao Shuai, the Chinese Olympic champion. Lauren Williams making it through. We'll find out will it be Guo Yun Fei or Nur Tatar Ascari. Ali Shahin will be hoping it is the latter. Yoshi coach in the corner for China. All success for his fighter. Take doesn't need much encouragement to come forward. Noted for an aggressive style, but of Nur Tatar's defensive abilities. Nice hook around the back there from the Turk, Nur Tatar Ascari. Asking the question. Dene, Dene, Sert, Dene, Ortoy, Dene, Brusina, Sert. 
Second, nothing doing, and no point scored. I hesitate to say pointless, I don't mean that in terms of the value of the action, but certainly in terms of the scoreboard. A defensive master against a subdued Gwalion Fate. Coach as well, needing a bit of water. Kim Gushik working hard. Lauren Williams awaits in the final. China or Turkey will meet her there. Mounting Tatara Scarry holding the centre. Brilliant feet. Hesitant. I've seen it all in Taekwondo. You've probably seen some of the demonstrations. The acrobatics. I've seen the high scoring battles. This one. A stalemate. Coming forward, Gwalion Fate. No Gamjons created by either fighter. Tense times for the win in Wushi. Oh, I don't think I've seen a single flicker of a light. See the little red and blue scores on the big scoreboard? There's a panel beside that. If a light goes on there, then you've scored. So far, no lights at all. Who will be the leading light in the last 30 seconds? Concentration from Nur Tartar, obvious. Nur Tartar is focusing. Valiant fate. Hesitant, we haven't seen a good punch from either fighter. Are we going towards the golden score? That leg turn and kick well blocked from Gwalion Fate. Clock ticks down. Will be the golden score. Both fighters dragging it out here. Summoning up the last vestiges of their energy. scores on the board and we are into the golden score round the semi-finals of the women's under 67s Turkey against China looking for a fight against Britain one minute to decide two points for whoever can find it points make Get those prizes. 
chief among them. The Olympic ranking points. Oh, indeed, for seventy thousand dollars for the winner of tomorrow's final. Who's going to be in there? I know that Lauren Williams is. Backline tunnicate just missing there. Bulgarian fade the big chop from Tataras Gary. Not landing. There's the shot from Nur Tataras Gary. Finds the space and finds herself into the final. She will go against Great Britain's Lauren Williams. Bulgarian fate will fight again for the bronze. Silver last time, the Chinese fighter, bronze this time, going for gold, Nur Tatar Ascari. <laughs> Top class from Turkey. Tremendous for her, Nur Tataris Gary. Valiant Faye defeated Nur Tatar. Delighted. Go. 